all right guys so what's up welcome back and in today's video i'm going to show you guys how to fix all the lag as fortnite has recently came out with the new performance mode it just came out today and i'm going to teach you guys how to turn it on and also i'm going to be teaching you guys how to delete the high resolution texture so uh, you can get 15 gigabytes of free space i think it's 14 or 15 gigabytes so yeah this video is also for integrated gpu so if you're if you have an intel uhd or hd kind of gpu you can still use that and get like at least 60 fps because of the new performance mode so yeah i'm going to teach you guys about the new performance mode how to turn it on and also other tweaks to get the best possible fps out of your pc and yeah it's going to fix all the issues and i'm doing a free battle pass giveaway so if you want to join that subscribe to the channel with notifications on like the video and comment down below your fortnite username and uh, let's just get straight into the video all right guys so i'm back in the video now i'm going to show you guys the best possible fortnite settings and also how to turn the performance mode on on and also how to delete the high resolution textures so yeah let's do it so yeah let's just get into it so what do you have to do just go in your menu and go over to your settings once you're here for window mode make sure it's full screen resolution set it to uh your native resolution if you're getting trash fps set it to lower fps limit is just set it to whatever you're getting consistently and for the graphics just set it to whatever you want this doesn't really affect the fps now graphics quality uh set everything to low but you can set the textures to high if you have a good enough GPU but have a trash uh, CPU. Uh, so it prevents a little bit of bottleneck. But yeah, you can do that. Now I'm going to be teaching you guys how to turn on the performance mode. So me think first off, turn that off. Motion blur, turn that, turn that off. Show FPS, turn it on. Alright guys, so rendering mode. Now this is how you change uh, your rendering mode to performance mode. So what you have to do is just press this button. Uh, and then click on confirm confirm and you'll be on the performance mode but guys you need to restart your game for the performance mode to take action so please restart the game and you'll be good to go now for these settings just turn it off uh, low latency turn it on if you want lower latency but for the best fps turn it off all right guys so now i'm going to be teaching you guys how to install the high resolution textures all right guys so what you have to do is just open up your epic games launcher uh once that's done just go over to library and you will see fortnite right here all right guys so if you want to install the high resolution textures what you have to do is click on the three dots head over to options now once you're here it'll say all this stuff so what do you have to make sure is make sure high resolution textures is unchecked and you'll get 15 gigabytes of extra space so suit do so do that and then press apply and then you're good to go all right guys so the next step is to make sure that you have the latest uh, cpu and gpu drivers now if you are using an nvidia gpu just download geforce now i have already downloaded it so once you don't do that just search up geforce now and then open it if you have a amd graphics card i can't help you because i don't have one but you can search on youtube how to update your amd graphics card it's really easy so you can do that so once you're here in geforce experience go over to drivers and then click on check for updates now once you click on check for updates it will say you have the latest game driver so for you, you might get an update. Uh, for me, I've already uh, updated to the latest one. But if you have an update, please update it as it will give you the best performance as it's the latest graphic card version and the game will be way better. And yeah, once you update your drivers, just head over to your settings. Once you're here, please turn on in-game overlay as it improves the performance and it also helps you to take videos, screenshots and every other kind of stuff easily. And it doesn't really hurt performance as much. So you can... You also use uh, in-game overlay to record your videos your you know instant replays or something whatever it is and yeah let's get on to the next step all right guys so in this step i'm going to be teaching guys how to make your uh, computer use more power for better performance because your your computer might be using less power to save power but if you want the best fps you, you want your computer to use a lot of power not a lot but it's still going to use a bit more power than it used to so what do you have to do is search up edit power now press enter once you're here uh click over to power options and then you will see balanced and high performance it's i have ultimate performance but it's still just uh, just the higher performance option it's just the name changed but yeah if you're unbalanced please set it to high performance all right so once that's done just close the window all right guys so in this step i'm going to be teaching you guys how to make your graphics card uh give the most priority to Fortnite. so when you're running the game uh it'll be smooth and your graphics card will just focus on fortnite and nothing else so how do you do it you may ask well what do you have to do is just search up uh just go in your search bar and type in graphics settings now once you do that 
Uh, click click over to browse so once you click that just go over where you can install the game i installed it in my c drive so once that's done just go over to fortnite then go to fortnite game then go to binaries then go to win64 once that's done you'll see all these things now what you have to do is just click on fortnite client win64 shipping now once that's done just click on it click on add and you have added and you have added it now what you have to do is go over and click on options and then click on high performance and then save i've already done it so i'm going to remove it but yeah you should do it and it will really help your performance all right guys so this is the next step and now this tweak is to fix the stutters and uh, input lag and yeah i found the this tweak from adamax thanks to adamax uh, his link will be in the description please subscribe to him but yeah but yeah this tweak is really helpful i just tried it and it, it really affected my performance and also gave me better less input lag and better fps so like uh, just a little bit but still it's gonna uh, reduce all the stutters and stuff Alrighty, so how do you do it you may ask well just go in your search button and then type in registry editor now you'll see this so just click on open and if it ask you to say yes or no just click on yes and this will open so guys what you have to do is go over to h key uh, local machine click on the arrow thing and then find system and then again click on the arrow thing now go over to the current control set click on it and then go to controls now scroll down to you find priority uh, control click on it and then you'll see these three files then just go double click on the windows 32 priority separation and then uh set the value to 28 make sure it's hexadecimal not decimal make sure it's hexadecimal and when you set it to 28 it's going to give you the uh, least uh, input lag and it's also going to be uh, it's also going to help you get um, less stutters so yeah do it and you'll be good to go you also don't have to restart for this to take effect so you, you don't even have to re restart I just go over in the creative match and check it out it really works and it really helped me out now press ok and you'll be good to go now you can close this all right guys so in this step i'm going to teach you guys how to fix stutters and this step is going to really help you with the stutters and stuff so what do you have to do well all right so just go in your file explorer so now just find where you stored fortnite so for me i installed it in my c drive so i'm just going to go where my fortnite is so it's right here so just go over to the fortnite folder uh it can be anywhere so just find your fortnite folder go over to fortnite and then go to fortnite game Go to binaries go to win64 and then you'll be here so you need to find the application called fortnite client win64 shipping now just right click on it click on properties once that's done go over to compatibility so once you're in compatibility what you have to do is just check the disable full screen optimization now once that's done go over to change high dpi settings and then uh, also check override high dpi scaling behavior just check on it click on ok click on that and click on ok and you'll be good to go now let's go over to the next step. All right, guys. So in this step, I'm gonna be teaching guys how to uh, how to turn off background apps. So you can need to stop background apps running, and which you know takes all the performance and stuff. So yeah. So what you have to do is just uh, go over to your search bar and again go to settings. Once you're here, uh, go over to privacy. Once you're there, scroll down till you find background apps. Now turn all of them off. They're just trash. Microsoft apps, which you don't need. They're all trash. Don't turn them on. And yeah, just turn all the background apps off. Once that's done, um, you can find notifications. I think yeah. So once once you are here, uh, just turn notifications off too. All right, guys. So this step is only for Nvidia graphics card users. So if you have an Nvidia graphics card, you can follow the steps. So what you have to do is just go over to your desktop and just right click and go over to your Nvidia control panel. Now, if you haven't on installed Nvidia control panel, please install it. Uh. I'm not going to go over how to, but yeah, just install it and then open it. Once that's done, you'll see this. Now, what you have to do is just go over to manage 3D settings. Now, once you're here, copy all my settings. So image uh, sharpening, just turn it off and all this stuff. Just turn all of these uh, image settings off. So just copy all my settings. They're all the best settings. And the, one of the most important settings is uh, power management mode. Now just set it to prefer maximum performance. Once that's done, also change the preferred refresh rate to the max you can do. So just change it to the highest available. Once that's done, just follow, uh, just copy all my settings, I guess. So yeah. Also texture filtering quality, turn it to high performance. You don't want better quality. 
more fps is better than better quality so yeah all right guys so just copy all my settings I'm, I'm again gonna go over it and yeah so just copy it and you'll be good to go all right guys thanks for watching the video i hope you enjoyed if you did subscribe to the channel with notifications on and like the video also comment down below what you want next join my uh battle pass giveaway and i'll see you guys in my next video peace